Whoa! Good morning, everybody. One of the best Christmas movies ever. I just thought I'd share this with you. It's uh, when I turn towards Columbus Farmer's Market. That's what you see. It's a Ford dealership. Gotta have a little Chevy Chase action. I love it, man. <laughs> How cool is that? You know that's a good freaking dealership. <laughs> <sighs> All right, guys. Let's keep going to uh, Columbus Farmer's Market. Oh my God. Oh, it's raining. It's a little chilly, but it's supposed to all stop in an hour or so. So meeting up with, um, oh, turn that off. Meeting up with uh, Leland and Matt today. Uh, I might run into some other people. So uh, come along, shall you? Uh, let's go and do stuff at the market. I'm going to sell more Hot Wheels and more stuff I dug out of the house to get rid of. Uh, we're cleaning, we're minimizing, we're doing stuff. Let's go to the flea market, gee. When you have like, you know, we hear the word Chris Kringle kind of coming in, in too, right? Yes. And during the Protestant Reformation, they were like, oh no, we there's no precedent for saints in the Bible. Like purgatory, there's no precedent for a lot of the things that the early church was all about. And so the Protestants were like, well, we can't recognize saints anymore. So that means we can't recognize St. Nicholas. And then, oh man, that's kind of sucky, right? Because St. Nicholas is super cool. So we have to do away with that. And so instead of having St. Nicholas as the gift giver, they change it to the Christ child is the gift giver and the gift giving day being Jesus's supposed birthday because, he, because he's not actually born on December 25th hopefully I'm not you know crushing people's spirits say that you know. all right guys it's uh 6 30 they just opened up the gates there's a lot of honking going on I think someone fell asleep someone always falls asleep and people have to drive around them but uh today is not as crazy like as I don't know if you can tell but last thursday this was packed like all of that was filled with cars uh today as you can see it's raining so i'm probably gonna just sit in the car for a while even after after i pull in there it's supposed to stop but <clears throat> i just don't want to waste like 20 25 bucks because it's a sunday for you know for a bust of a flea market so we'll see i'll keep you posted sometimes it rains sometimes it pours oh man all right guys i pulled in uh, here's my spot people are rolling in it's kind of cold kind of windy so i am not gonna set up until the raindrops stop falling on my head because i do care so moving on all right aaron uh aaron's doing a back backyard deal everybody's a ninja back there <laughs> but yeah look at these two guys that i just met up with <laughs> you got your leland power you got your matt power max power man look at these beautiful setups what would you dollar store nice all right, we can't we can't be recording their deals. <laughs> trains, trains. My brother just got a. Oh yeah. To the hospital yesterday. Oh god. He's like, yeah, look at uh, my back. It's a rash. I'm like, bro, it's a fucking shingle, man. That's painful. <laughs> Should I not have touched you? <laughs> no, he said, um. You, it's yeah, already crusted, so he's on he's he's like recovery mode. Oh right god, now. okay. Yeah. <laughs> Look at him, that's like shivering. The and... Oh no! Ah, I wish I had Jedi power. I do not. <laughs> oh man. Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> I was like, no! Uh, I'm no Jedi. But yeah. Oh, yeah. May the Schwartz be with you. The Schwartz. That's right. <laughs> Ooh, Russian nesting doll. Should grab that and set it on fire. Well, uh, uh, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, there he is. Yeah, he's just like me. Like, I got a bunch of cardboard. I ain't setting up yet. <laughs> just noticed that Shelby Cobra in there. Look at all those other good-looking cars. 
please ask first. <laughs> At your service. All right. Hey man. Hey, how you doing? How, how much is that guy? I do five dollars on him. He's a crack in the windshield, but is it, well, yeah, is it sure. something or is it just plastic or metal? No, or? no, it's metal. It's die yeah. cast. Yeah, well, it's let just... me check it out. Right, five see. bucks ain't bad. No, because he has a crack. Yeah, I cracked his windshield. Oh, uh, okay. It's all right, but he's, he's die cast. Okay. What does that even buy? It's just a big ass. I forget now, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I had ten on him, but I cracked this windshield out there. I said five bucks. Man. Oh man, yeah, that's that's a bummer. Yeah, looks realistic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's a uh... no. What? I oh, thought it was. No, a... it's not a pullback. No. All right, it's like heavy enough. Oh yeah, it's I guess. So it's, I mean, right. Right, these things are like fifteen bucks. You know, anywhere yeah. else, but that's yeah. cool. Uh, I'll probably get back to it. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, yeah. that windshield. Dang it. Yeah, well, I'll just be honest with you, you know, I, don't, I don't sell anything unless I, you know. I appreciate full that. Full disclosure, you know, I know. <laughs> yeah. I'm digging that sign. All of them, actually. Mitch, how much is the standard sign? Uh, that's 20. A bajillion. <laughs> cool. It's a repro sign. Where's the head? Oh, wow, it's a it's repro? A that's not bad. It's a heavy repro. Yeah, repo. they're like... Not bad. If that was like a mobile, I'd be all over that. I mean, if you have a marker, <laughs> you make it into a mobile. Just spray it white and just oh, paint yeah. whatever you want on it. You're an artist, aren't you? <laughs> oh my god. Artist, who are you? Of, uh, you know. Yeah, I mean, you're not wrong. I could do that. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna stop. Whew, just had a talk with, with my boy Leland, uh, you know, about loss and all that. It keeps like coming at me like um, a lot of people that I know just lost their dads. I have a lot of support. I'm blessed with you friends, you good friends, you and Matt had to go to. We talked to him last Thursday. So man, it's been it's been a ride. All right, I'm gonna set up. There's my two tables. I hope there's still my two tables. Sometimes people take things. Okay, so it started to like ice, ice rain, <laughs> which sucks. So everyone's packing stuff up, sadly. Uh, well, just to wait, to wait it out. I was kind of expecting this to happen. I can chuckles over there, nonstop chuckles. It's freaking enough already. But anyway. <laughs> Hang in there guys, hopefully it'll warm up, the sun will come up and I can get rid of some of this unwanted goods. <laughs> Alright. So I've secured the secret stuff from Da Aaron. Look at this, look at this. It's a kilo. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, it's empty. Alright. <laughs> uh, oh! Oh! Oh, you broke it. You want it now. Everything one-handed. Say hi to your lady. Oh, too late now. There we go. So we've pure procured this. Maggie's been looking for this for her niece for a yeah, long ass time. Ooh, <laughs> it, I guess stuff comes out of it. Yeah, you put like powders in there and then this like little magical creature comes out and the kids get five seconds of enjoyment for $80 and then- Trash. Yeah, well, you get this nice cardboard that the kids Ooh, nice. with more. They'll um, draw on that. Yeah, so. Hey. That's, that's the hot toy of the season, folks. Yeah, look at that. Jeez. Yeah, Matt had to go to a guy that's like backed up with a truck and he's like, hello, hello, uh, sir, sir Aaron, right? Your name Aaron? Okay. I give you, uh, you, you give me $80 or $100. Well, okay. You know what? Give me $120. <laughs> and I say, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, I punch you. How about knuckle sandwich? <laughs> anyway, so Aaron just battled someone to get that for me. I brought battle. We brought battle. <laughs> nice. Thanks, man. You just made the little girl really happy. Yeah, I'm glad I made it. Oh, it has to go upside down. Yeah. <laughs> we messed up. <laughs> Damn rules. Well, let, let's watch Aaron drop it. You know what? <laughs> all right. All right, you guys. You don't need to see the rest of this. We're about That's to all. We're about to talk. <laughs> see, you know you have a good friend when he brings you food, man. A Leland, bro. This is so good. I don't know what it's called. I don't know, it's just Korean too. 
No, hey, Maggie. Oh my God, I'm gonna save that for Maggie. Oh yeah, Maggie is coming for you. <laughs> Thanks, Leland. Yeah, man. Okay, guys, uh, it stopped freaking snowing, so I'm on my way to get some coffee. There's Aaron again. <laughs> yeah. Jump, jump, crisscross the make you. I'm just getting some coffee. <laughs> Ooh. I got cans. They're multiplying. And they're sucking. I'm done with that song. Sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I know you're here for the song. My beautiful voice, but, you know, sometimes you gotta just give them a taste. Mike's coffee, yay! All right, man. They uh, I just stopped by Mike's, got the coffee, and they put a Hershey chocolate bar on top of my coffee. I was like, why? He's like, you're uh, our one million customer. <laughs> I was like, what? So I don't know what that was all about, but um, very much appreciate it though. Thank you, Mike, if you're watching this. Uh, no, not that one. Okay, boombox. I need to get me one of them bigger ones. <sighs> Your mom. That's my guess. <laughs> Wonderful. Look at that. Poops. Got some poops. Got some whoops. Not much cool stuff glad i don't care about tops don't even want to look at them man oh jeez oh whoa 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 that's pretty cool huh. awesome Got some video games, video games. Hey, I know James. <laughs> uh, I'm good. I just want to say East New York's finest in the house. It's been a yeah, while. It's been like two is, years since you've graced it's been our a video. While since I gone and things up just like I always had. It's, it's been, been a while. while since I <laughs> oh, me <laughs> too, man. Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I love you, man. Uh, you too, brother. Uh, all right, you guys go to his channel. His rants are epic. Yes, I am. Every freaking rant, just listen to it. <laughs> I, I creep on him. I don't comment, but I'll listen. Everybody does. <laughs> Is there a in the box? Of the yeah, you have that. Okay. Uh, dude, I, there's so many there. Okay. Uh, of that one, you can have it. Don't let him bully you. No, it's good. <laughs> no, I offer to pay every single time. We 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 have an arrangement. There's <laughs> there's sexual favors involved. <laughs> Don't tell his wife. Don't tell my wife. Don't tell. I mean, I know all you guys do live in the city. My wife is the one telling me to do it. Hey, yeah. <laughs> we <laughs> put the love in, brother. Uh -huh. What? what? <laughs> my wife told him told me to do it, so I don't bother her. So that's what I'm saying. Okay, okay, that makes sense. All right, I'm gonna take this camera off, you guys. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Hey man, <laughs> nice J Jail sub. Look everyone, it's Dan. At the market. I know he looks Ukrainian, but he's not. He's, not. he's Russian. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Uh, those are ten each. My sister. If you get a bunch of stuff, man, I'll work with you. But yeah. Oh yeah, we're we're talking personal. So that's Dan. So that's it. He said hi. a lot of nutcrackers. Don't crack your nuts. That was a joke. It was a joke, okay? A nutcracker, ha ha ha. Uh, Johnny's not here, sadly. I wanted to get more of his loose premiums for for wheel swaps, but not here. All right. <sighs> We're 
wrap repair. Oh, jewelry repair. I'm like, what the heck? It's backwards. I think this is what, uh, no, that's not what Leland was talking about. It's like inkjet, inkjet stuff. Oh, he was talking about him. All right. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Zordon. Zordon, Zordon. That Korean shish kebab Leland brought me? Holy crap, that was good. I might go, like, before I go home, I might grab a whole bunch more. Like, I saved one for Maggie, but I might eat that one and then get her some fresh ones right before I leave. <sighs> ah, man. It's funny how a lot of people do not like people like me that walk around filming. I get it. But at the same time, me filming lets you guys watch this stuff. Especially people that can't come out, you know? Hey, Midnight Toker. Shout out to you. Check it out. It's your sort of a uh, booth. Hats. Stuff. Oh, this is where uh, Big Baller stuff is at. Yeah. Some meat. People, people touching your meat. Uh, I like never go under, under these roofs. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I mean, if you're a smoker, why are you freaking smoking? You know, and uh, ooh, Hitari Hanzo. I used to be really into katanas. I only have one nowadays. And my katana is full tang. Ooh, hats. Ooh, stuff. Ooh, hoodies. Yeah, the, so everything under the roofs, basically people are always here. They're here every day of the week selling. You know, knockoff merch. I'm not gonna keep walking through there. I don't like that area. Sorry, everyone that sells stuff in there. <laughs> don't hate me. I just have no need for any of that stuff. But a lot of people do, so. You know, just saying. It's my opinion. Everyone has one like a butthole. Oof. Pineapple. Alright, guys, so. Uh, I had one guy come, this is like what I was hoping for. This dude walked up to me and just offered me a nice lump sum to buy out my, my table. Like basically all my basics, uh, my treasure hunts, my um, red editions, all that good stuff. So, I'm happy, he's happy, I gave him a heck of a deal. So, uh, he's gonna make money and I made money and I don't have to come out and set up at the market anymore. Next time I'm gonna be here, it's gonna be just to walk around and uh, buy stuff. <laughs> the, the hoarding continues, I guess. But anyway, he told me to stop by his van. He said he has some stuff. I'm not sure where he is. Oh, there he is. There's my man. Cool. Yeah. So if you guys are in Columbus, buy his stuff. <laughs> cool. So there's our bagel bums, and there's some people. But, uh, oh, it's just back bum, back bum. Nothing like a back bum. <laughs> All right, I stocked up on some uh, bagels for me and Maggie and my mom. They're delicious, man. If you guys are ever here, bagel bums. I endorse it. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, let's have a look, see, huh? I don't think it's gonna get you there. I'm gonna try to not move around too much so you guys can enjoy looking at things. Oh, he killed a bird and he's wearing his skin. That's harsh, Pooh. Hey, man. 
What's up, man? How you doing? I'm doing. Good. Good. Wanted to take a look at what you got. All right. I didn't want to film too much on his table. He's a good dude. Um, didn't want to give up his prices and stuff. Oh, oh man. Some good looking stones. They'll stone you when you're trying to get some sleep. They'll stone you when you're trying to get some milk. I'll just try to stone you for everything. Stones. Stones and junk. <laughs> Thank you. All right. You know what's not very nice? Offering me a psychic reading. <sighs> That's always creepy. Oh man, that table's about to give. The table's on the edge, and it's about to a break. <laughs> Stuff. Hi, kitties. Star Wars. <laughs> How much is it? Some kind of card? Some kind of card. That Times Square piece is cool. Wow, alright. It's not looking it's not looking good guys. I'm glad that I was able to sell my stuff. So yeah, um, Gonna go back to my car, get out of here. Uh, I am so happy that I got rid of those things, man. I have like one bin left, like a small bin, none of the blue bins. Like I have a blue bin, but it has the loose cars in it, which ugh, I'll save like in a pile for when I send people stuff and I can like, I don't know, uh, whatchamacallit. Sorry, I'm getting sidetracked looking at tables over there, and you're not looking at them. You're looking at my fluffy face. But anyway, um, where was I? I'll just turn this off and remember what I was talking about. All right. This looks like a weird mishmash, probably a house clean-out guy. Oh, that's a handsome fella. <sighs> Is it just me, or do these uh, bunnies look kind of inappropriate? I don't know. Kind of grim, man. Looking grim. All right. Uh-huh. I love their little art pieces here. Like 3D stuff, regular stuff. Got this stuff, stuff and junk. I'm saying stuff. Everybody's listening. They have no choice. Because I'm filming and talking. Uh, here's some more of those Han bunnies. I guess they're uh, hand purses. They just don't look right to me. Like, they're not cute. They just look like they're dead. So, kind of weird. Man, guys, the, it smells so good out here. Oh, he wanted the, you, you don't have the brown? Everyone's uh, cooking stuff up. Whoa. Jesus Christ. It's getting crowded. I am so happy I got rid of all that stuff, guys. You have no idea. Bones. Ah. Hey, it's that guy. Photo with Santa. Get them while you can. Happy St. Nicholas Day, everybody. I should go take a photo with them for the thumbnail. But I know I won't. Okay. Let's see. Got some stuff. It's really nothing on the tables. I don't know if you guys can tell. It's like, uh, undis, undis I know what it says, calm down. No, it's not, it said this. It's not undisputed. It's undisputed. You guys can freaking deal with it. 
Ninja vanish. Wind is relentless, guys. Look at this. It's crazy. If I still had Hot Wheels out here, they'd be flying all over the place. They're probably flying all over the place now. Oh, I already filmed this aisle for you guys. Tropical Spanish food. Oh yeah, that's good stuff. <laughs> nice. Wawas. Oh my god. Man, it is windy. You guys have no idea. Oh yeah. Cozy things. Yeah, this is boring. I'm gonna stop filming this. Really? This is insane. I was waiting for a Doors one. There it is. I can't wait. I need to find out how much this is. I'm about to waste all the money I made today. Oh, man. Yeah, that's it. You guessed it. Um. Oh yeah, I gotta get some gas. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna get some gas. I'll show you what I picked up. I bought one thing, well, two things. One thing I bought for Maggie, which you saw earlier, that weird whatever thing for her niece. And um, I got something too. And I was blown away by the price and what it is. It's freaking awesome. So stick around for a minute. I'll show it to you. Uh, I just need to go get some gas and and take a, take a whiz. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, just gonna show you what I picked up real quick. It's um, one thing. I mean, it's one thing, but it's uh, one thing of many things, which is kind of weird. Check it out. Freaking Indian motorcycles, right? That's my absolute favorite uh, motorcycle company. And this has like amazing little bikes. I'm definitely going to keep a couple of these. There's a bunch of like there's doubles in here and stuff, but man, keep an eye out for a video on this. What's this one? Is this just an empty box? Yeah, that's an empty box. Um, but yeah, I basically paid like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Paid a dollar each for these. How crazy is that? So I'll just pull this one out. There's obviously. Oh, wait. So yeah, that one box was probably back there. So there's probably one missing. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, these are fantastic, man. Again, I'm not a bike guy, but uh, if you guys ever heard of a movie called World's Fastest Indian, if you haven't, check it out. It's a true story starring Hannibal Lecter. <laughs> Sorry. Starring uh, Anthony Hopkins. Um, but yeah, um, Indian, man. Indian bikes. <sighs> but yeah, paid 10 bucks for that, which is, you know, I'm glad that I reserved myself. I uh, didn't buy too much stuff that I don't need. So I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, yeah, so let me know, guys. Did you like today's uh, Flea Market Days episode? Was it boring? Did you enjoy it? Uh, what do you think of my uh, 130, 132 scale <laughs> die cast uh, with plastic Indian bikes? And that's it. Thanks for watching, everyone. I can't believe that I sold uh, <laughs> sold all those Hot Wheels. I'm so happy that dude approached me. And uh, he's like, you know, how much? I'm like, well, blah, blah, blah. He counted them all. He's like, I'll give you this. I'm like, nah, man. So I was like, nah, man, nah. <laughs> but yeah, I feel really weird when someone like pulls up next to me. There's a little girl sitting there. So I'm going to pull the heck away uh, and continue talking. Whew, all right. So yeah, that's it. Um, like I said, <laughs> again, sorry. I keep like when I cut, I forget what I was talking about. So I end up like telling you the same thing five times over. But um, I'm just happy that I sold that, man. I really got sick and tired of going to the market. Like on Sunday, just to get a spot, it's $30. On Thursday, it's like $25 or $20, I forget. But uh, yeah, it's like that adds up if you're going there constantly. And it really like, you know, takes a big chunk out of, you know, what you're trying to make back for, you know, the reason why you're at the flea market. So um, those of you who are wondering, but yeah, this flea market is now open every day. That's like their new thing. They're announcing it. Everyone's telling you, yeah, we're open every day now. So if any of you are in the tri-state area, go to Columbus farmer's market and, uh, enjoy it. You know, there's a lot of good deals to be had here.
Uh, but yeah, cool. I'm happy. Uh, <laughs> I have all this room now in my uh, house. It, it took me three trips to the flea market and you guys got three episodes. And uh, like I said earlier, uh, from now on when I go to the flea market or flea markets, I talked to a whole bunch of my friends today that um, you know are going to different markets and they're like, yeah, let's just go together or whatever. So I'm like, yeah. So keep an eye out for that. So flea market days is definitely going to be a returning series. Um, I'm going to keep adding to that 200 plus episodes that are already in the playlist that you're watching right now. So check out my older episodes. There's some amazing stuff, amazing funny things and the crazy finds I've got over the years there. So yeah, cool. Uh, you know, productive day, successful day, got some money back gonna put that money towards getting a new laptop for for everything that I do uh, because my laptop burned out it's crazy like when it rains it pours you know like all the stuff happens and just everything breaks down you just need to get new things you know whatever so um, so yeah this was good I'm just happy that all that stuff got sold um, so yeah uh, don't hit me up for treasure hunts or red editions or Zamex anymore I don't have any of them they're all gone. I just have stuff that's in my collection. No doubles, no triples. Um, that's actually kind of reassuring and I'm happy about that. So I do have doubles, maybe triples of certain castings. <laughs> just not of all castings, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. Um, okay guys, uh, thank you for watching. I'm not gonna ramble on too long unless I, I'm driving and something pops into my head. I'll be like, oh, let's talk for half an hour. <laughs> but yeah, I don't think that's gonna go down today. Uh, I just want to get home. There's a lot more to do today. It's Sunday, um, but yeah. All right. Uh, so yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you all in the next video, whatever it's going to be. Live long and prosper. That's it. Bye. All right. It's Fred time. Whoa. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I just remembered the one thing that happened uh, today. So right when the other guy bought bought up my table and everything uh there was a dude walking up and by the way i'm not blaming him for anything oh i have a phone call i guess hold on so uh there's scalpers and stuff going on at the market <clears throat> it, it always happens people are always trying to make a buck it's the flea market um one thing is his deal actually wasn't that bad but uh i have a I have somebody sending this to me, uh, so I don't need to buy a second one. So, here's the thing. Uh, I just finished selling uh, all my like main lines and all that carded stuff to, um, to this gentleman. And as I'm packing this stuff up, this one dude walks up, he's like, yo, yo. I was like, hey, what's up? I don't know, maybe you watch my videos, man. I'm not sure. You seem to say like, I know a lot when I was saying I like Dotsons. So I'm not sure. But anyway, if you're watching, I'm not like judging you for doing this, but um, you know, so this dude walks up and he pulls out the, the two pack of Datsun 510s and he's like, you know, $22. And I'm like, uh, you know, <laughs> like it's a little too much. Cause I think in the, in the store, I guess he just wanted to double his money or maybe like he bought two and he wanted to sell one so that one he can sell and make his money back so um god come on guys the lane's ending like obviously this arrow is pointing for you to get off that lane why are you hogging the lane jerks all right i'm gonna get out of this lane because oh, of course now you're turning uh, <clears throat> all right cool i i flashed oh thanks man uh, yeah, I let a truck through. That's nice when you flash them, you know, with your lights, and then they give you a little hazard light thank you. It's good etiquette, man. I like that. People don't just, like, cut you off like jerks. But, um, any hoozles. Yeah, so he's offering me this uh, two-pack dots and uh, 510 pack. And I, I gotta say, I was tempted because I just sold my table to the guy. You know, I, I made a couple of bucks, so that's good. By the way, those of you who might call me a freaking um, scalper, shame on you because you know, you're a jerk. You shouldn't judge people. <laughs> uh, but yeah, <clears throat> so yeah, maybe I should have bought it. Oh man, but anyway, I'm about to stray off because I also found the, the doors 
waiting for the sun, uh, the Funko Pop set of four. Man, he wanted 85 bucks or whatever. Uh, I don't know. I guess it's... Anyway, that's straight enough. <laughs> uh, but anywho... Uh, God, I have so much to freaking... I want to like let out of my head. But it's there's too much things coming out. So, let's stick to the dots. So, he's like, yeah, you want this for 22? And the other dude that bought my son, he's like, no, no, no. That's, uh, you know... Uh, they were speaking, I think, in Spanish, and he's like, no, too much, too much. Then he looks at me, I'm like, yeah, no, I'm good, man. Um, so, yeah, uh, you know, it, it's kind of weird because, like, obviously, he didn't pay for the table to sell at the flea market. He didn't pay $30 that day. You know, if I didn't go to that market and didn't pay for my table, I wouldn't be able to sell all of my, you know, Hot Wheels that I was selling. Um, and I definitely wouldn't sell them walking around the market, you know, for free, just trying to offer people deals or whatever. Uh, I feel like that's not fair, you know, to people that actually pay for their tables. So, I mean, there you go. I paid 30 for my table and, uh, you know, I could have just paid him for those Datsuns. Anyway, I'm having trouble with, like, speaking. I'm not angry. It's not a rant. You know, I, it's just kind of like weird, you know, like, I don't know, I don't like when people do that, you know, like, we all paid for our tables, bro, you know, um, it's kind of weird that you're just walking up to people randomly offering them things. Um, hey, I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> right, 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 okay, cool. So, yeah, all right, guys, so that was my little mini rant, uh, you know, I'm, in a way, I'm almost like, not regretting, but you know, 22 is not bad. It's like $12 per cart. No, it's bad. It's not a good deal. Um, I did see other people at the flea market, flea market trying to sell those, like other Hot Wheels vendors. Um, oh man, uh, Hot Wheels Johnny wasn't here today. Sadly, I was looking for him. Uh, he's usually there Sundays. I don't know. Uh, I guess he was afraid of the, the rain or whatever. I mean, he's selling Hot Wheels. They'll all get damaged. Oh man, so yeah, uh, so yeah, they were selling them for 30, and I'm like, whoa, 30 is like, ew, that's a little, that's a little out there, uh, you know, for that, but I guess, you know, these, these guys were, they're actually resellers, which I have no problem with resellers, I have a problem with scalpers, but once your prices get to the scalper level, you're not a reseller, you're officially a scalper now, so... You know, it's one of those things that's just weird. There's such a fine line between that. Uh, but I rant a lot about scalping and the difference between resellers, scalpers, and all that. Some people are really pick-headed and just bundle everything together. I don't care. If you buy new stuff and you sell it, you're a scalper. No, you're wrong. You're totally wrong, bro. Uh, so yeah, I've actually like stopped talking to a bunch of people on YouTube, uh, some YouTubers that had that opinion about that. It's not fair, man. It's not fair. It's okay to resell things. Especially if you're just trying to pay for legit things and that's your pretty much only way to do it. And that's what I mean by, by that is like, you don't know what that person's story is. Like, let them sell things. It's fine. You don't have to pay that crazy price. Like me and that one vendor that was selling the, you know, the Datsun set for, um, for 30. Like, that's fine. I mean, if I was really looking for one, I'd probably pay him that. But... I walked away from him friendly and peaceful and you know we shook hands because he's a cool dude um, I'm not gonna tell you who he was because he might be watching this and I actually have bought many Hot Wheels from him in the past so and I will in the future so hey man if you're watching let me know next time I'm trying to buy something from you be like hey man were you talking about me I'll be like yeah man and then he'll like here's a knuckle sandwich two for one and I'm like ah <laughs> let's hope that doesn't happen I don't like, I don't like knuckle sandwiches, they're not tasty, plus I'm, I'm getting my teeth done right now, I, I, I need to keep them in my mouth, so, alright, now this is uh, straying off the topic again, it's good exercise to talk in the car while you drive because it gives you like multi-functioning abilities, you know, it gives you a certain particular set of skills to, to drive and talk, I'm special, so uh, yeah, so yeah, guys, I mean, that was kind of weird for me that someone walked up and tried to just sell stuff to me like that. Uh, that's happened before. They just kind of look for people that sell some, something that they have. And then they're like, well, he's a dealer. He's selling this. 
But then again, it's like, well, if you think I'm a dealer and you're trying to sell me something to sell stuff, how am I gonna make money off of $22 that I just wasted on this two pack? So, but yeah, man, if you were just trying to offer this to me and you're, you're watching my channel, you didn't mention anything about watching my channel or whatever, so I don't know. I can't assume that about people. <laughs> But uh, yeah, uh, just, uh, you know, um, thank you for the offer. That was uh, nice of you. 22 is not bad at all, but uh, it's always good, it, which is my point. Maybe don't bitch too much to people about it. Like, yeah, you know, maybe I don't find that like ethically right, or I don't think that's cool that people, you know, sell things for three times or twice the price. Um, scalper price, basically, eBay. <laughs> I think $30 is more than eBay, actually. I don't even know. But, uh, but yeah, um, yeah, it's okay to say no, uh, and just let it go. Uh, if someone has the money for it, that's why resellers and scalpers and, uh, people at the markets or yard sales, they make money, especially if they sell something for way too much of a price. Um, what they do is, uh, they, people buy it. So what's wrong with that? If someone's giving you $50 for something you paid a dollar for, I guess it's okay. Well, I mean, who am I to uh, judge either of those? This guy's like, it's $50. This guy's like, I'm cool with that. And uh, there, why why should I be the one that uh, that has issues with it? You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. So, yeah, uh, on that, uh, hopefully I made sense to you guys. Um, you know, it was just something that I really didn't like looking at. Uh, and yeah, so I gave you my two cents. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed my two cents and uh, give me one cent back in the comments below. Let me know what your one cent is about those thoughts. If I made sense. Let me make some sense from not making sense. <sighs> I burped. I had 7-Eleven taquitos. Two for two twenty nine. dollars Steak and cheese. <laughs> don't. Just don't. It's, it's sitting right here. And I have a feeling I'm gonna have a ring of fire later. And it burns, burns, burns. The ring of fire down there in the, no, no, downstairs area. <laughs> All right, I'm just having fun with you guys. Thank you for uh, understanding my humor, those of you that do, those of you that think I'm special. You're probably right too. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Live long and prosper, peace and love and unity. Spread that positivity, guys. Don't be assholes. Peace.